The Great Bear Rainforest in total is 25% of the temperate rainforest globally. And what we have done through these agreements is protected 80% of that. We have over 30 working agreements with the various stakeholders and combinations of stakeholders and with First Nations uh, that make up the Great Bear Rainforest Agreements. We have um, direct uh, agreements with uh, Joint Solutions Project, which is a coalition of environmental groups and the forest sector. So quite a, a very complicated overarching structure, uh, but one that allows us to declare victory on a, on a whole host of process. The agreements were developed in collaboration with First Nations and we were able to hear um, very powerfully about their cultural and economic interests. And uh, ecosystem-based management gives a, a lot of certainty as to where development can occur without uh, irreparably damaging the ecology of the area. This benefits uh, the citizens of British Columbia because it provides an opportunity for harvesting in certain areas. Plus, we've developed these human well-being agreements so that the First Nations can now develop their communities, they can create more jobs, more training, then it's great for uh, the environmental uh, societies as well. This has been a 20-year project, two decades of work from all sorts of folks across the, the province. I think it's an example of organizational excellence because it has involved so many people uh, internal to government. People have had children, they've grown up, they've gone to university. Uh, it's been a very long project and um, if it wasn't for the passion and dedication of the staff involved, uh, it probably wouldn't have happened. In my view, this is an unprecedented collaboration between uh, the forest sector, between environmental groups, and across government. Uh, many agencies had to come together to make this work, and they did come together. And in doing so, we have also created uh, a system where First Nations have ongoing access to economic activities, and uh, we've advanced many relationships and moved the dial considerably in terms of reconciliation with First Nations peoples.